THQ they released a new video over on their YouTube channel which features Brian Williams run through all the new additions to this year's create modes of which you'll find the link to the video in the description and you can also access it via the annotation on screen. So first up there's a few things that we already know that were revealed previously and they include the return of the custom skin colours so you no longer type the preset colours that were shown last year and also the return of transparency for tattoos and designs. Switching the new additions and there's the colour history option that I previously revealed which stores the last 10 custom colours that you've used for easy access and the new kick pad option that can be selected once you've chosen your superstar's footwear of which there is 5 kick pad designs to choose from and they can all be customised using designs, logos and custom paint tool data. Switching modes and we're also shown the first official footage of the new stage designs for Create an Arena and the venue sizes we can choose from which feature 5 different sizes and include outdoor options for Tribute the Troops and Wrestlemania 9. There's also footage of stage designer options for the Smackdown Fist Arena that shows some of the options available when editing that specific stage, however the stage specific options will be different for the base stage that you choose, but you will be able to customise the stage floor, ramp, lighting and other areas for all arenas. Create a Finisher is also featured in the video which is something I don't think I've mentioned in much detail but it's actually been renamed to Special Move this year as the moves you make are no longer restricted to just finishers with the option to use the moves as signature moves as well this year. As for the moves there's new additions of which the Package Pile Driver is one of the moves featured in the video. And sticking with moves but switching to create a move set, this year we'll have the option to change the limb target moves so we don't see every superstar use the same moves to target certain areas, with options to change these moves for all four standing grapple positions, giving you at least 16 new customizable moves to add to your move set. Create a storyline is next and there's a few new scenes shown, some of which are superstar specific in regards to the moves shown, such as the RKO, but you can still change the cast, just not the move. Of the new scenes shown, there's the Eddie Guerrero chair scene and the branching scenes of the spear off the stage and Vince giving the rock a chair, along with additional scenes such as Kane beating up Zack Ryder as he is stretched out of the arena. Finally, some online footage is also shown which as previously announced confirms the use of custom arenas in online matches. So this is a quick run through of the news, make sure to check out the original video for a thorough look at the modes as it lasts for a good 17 minutes and let me know what you think below.